All right, hello everybody. So I'm doing a video on my laptop and stuff that came. Um, so yeah, why don't we get to unboxing this awesome stuff? I think I need more light in here too. Whoops. There we go. Uh, that might be a little bit better. Scissors. Okay. Oops, there's one bigger. Alright, so this is my new laptop. It's the same one that I have for my iRuby. That somewhere for one or two. Bags are not. So, I'm going to have to open this. I'm hoping this will fit the laptop. Pretty big. It's exactly the same way. Thing. And there's a strap. Pretty big compartments. All fit in there, no problem. I just know it. It's not like new. Same exact thing as my old one, so I'll put this aside. Oh, well, after it falls. Ah, now for the good stuff. I mean, good, good stuff. Um, I got this at $532 on Amazon. Um, I wasn't looking for like high, high specs, but I was very happy to find this as DDR4 in a 200 memory and a SSD hard drive in it. Bigger than 32 gigabytes, of course. That's what pissed me off the most, was what after Windows 10 was done destroying my tablet. It gave me about 8 gigabytes of usable space left so it's like that's handy. I think this is a box within a box. But hey one oh come on. guys can see this all right. And of course it says that uh, lithium ion battery stuff on it. Do not load transport package if damaged. Well, that makes sense. So, so seal is not broken so that's good so I can cut the seal. Oh, now we better check contents. <laughs> And you guys can't see it. Oops. How is it supposed to open that? Ready? I'm gonna do it. Oh. Let's see what we got. We got the setup guide, which I'm gonna use that. I normally use that. Travelers, well, that's not pertaining to me. Uh, I don't know, that's the FCC, probably for the Wi Fi. So, starting on the left side, we have the seems to be the power stuff, it's pretty small. We got more cardboard than not. Yeah. I had Easter before, it was okay. Um, it wasn't very high high stuff in this box. Is Oops, dropped it already. Alright guys. Ready for it? I'm going to just drop this. Oops, hey. Awesome. Okay, this stuff can go. Boy, I got so much stuff in my room now. Alright, 
give me like one second. I'm gonna go clean up my room. Oh yeah, one more thing before I do that. Better make sure this fits. Ugh. It should. It does. All right. All right, I'm gonna go clean up my room and I'll be right back. All right, after I clean it up, I'm just working on uh, taking out this stuff. The other important stuff. There's that stuff. So this looks like it's got a actual fast speed charger. Not fast speed charger. Those are the little chargers instead of actually plugging it in. Alrighty, so I'm going to read I'll follow instructions because normally that's a good thing to do, I think. Alrighty, so we have the set of guide. One. Alright, so it says to connect power. Okay. All right, after just fighting with that thing, oh, well, we got to remove the plastic so it don't burn down the house. That's kind of helpful. Okay, now I think I'm going to route this to my other power supply. And that's what I'm going to do. Hey. Really? It's already bent. Oh well. That's probably me. Maybe it wasn't. So after I try to plug them in the wrong end, I'm gonna plug them in this end. And then I'm gonna set it on this side, so I'm guessing it's right. Takes me about forty different tries to get the thing on. Crap. There. All right. So now, after having that plugged in, I need a light. So, oh, okay. So we have a light. That's good. Uh, plug in before turning off finish time. Press the power button. Okay. Will do. And there's no... Oops. You can see the bottom, so I actually shouldn't say oops. It's uh, hard drive. I already got my stupid dust on my desk. Darn it. Looks very upgradable, I will say that. So... It's supposed to say 12 hour battery life, which is crazy because that means that I won't have to take my case around for the whole day. Alright, so now it says to hit, hit the power button. Before we do that, I just want to read some of the specs. Um, ultra fast wireless. Uh, this has got an Intel Core i5 6200. Nin G and NVIDIA GeForce 940MX, 8GB uh, DDR4 memory. Alright, where was I? 8GB DDR4 memory and 256GB 
SSD. I've never used an SSD. Someone's like, well, you should get one on your desktop. So, uh, come on, Canon, focus. Ugh. So Yeah, and this supposedly is a backlit keyboard, and it's got an i5. I personally love Intel. and I got a webcam. I like how that's silver. This is very nice. I'm very happy with it so far. Whoa. We have contact. Now I want to see how fast this boots up. Because this is going to be something crazy, supposedly, with SSD. Well, it's going the same speed as the other one will. Oh, never mind. <laughs> never mind. I'm so excited. Look at it. It's back like two guys. Get on Christmas. Hmm. Okay, so I'm going to get rid of that, and then we'll see how we do. Of course, now it's going through all the... Oh, of course, now it's going to get that update. So, yeah, so far it's going pretty smooth. Um, I like it. The only thing i got to get used to is it doesn't have all those clicky things. Um, yeah, it, it it's actually built in. It's not an actual clicking thing, which I think is great, because uh, my old laptop, HP Pavilion... Uh, what is it? And I'm not going to create an account because that's a pain. That's the one thing, but I'll get that in a second. So anyway, my HP Pavilion has those two rocker keys, and over time they get worn out and they get really loose and fobbly, which with this, I don't think we're going to have that problem. I think if anything, the pad's going to go. But I highly doubt. I've never seen that in a laptop. Um, because we all know we've seen, I don't know if you guys have seen it, me replacing my HP Pavilion screen. And that's when I've learned that I hate working on laptops, even though I just bought one. Oh, well. So anyway, the one thing about Make It Yours from Windows, it's great. I like it. You have all your documents in one spot. It's good. The downside is if you want different settings on each of the computers, it's a rotten pain in the butt because, of course, I have, you know, my desktop pictures of, you know, Megan Fox and all that stuff. So what's funny is when I boot up my tablet at school, I have to switch my background to my other theme which is my YouTube theme, uh, and then therefore, you know, it will uh, have better backgrounds that I'm not really worried about. It's nothing, you know, that is on there. It's just, I don't think it's very professional to have stuff there. Yeah, I'll get back to this. Um, of course, you can see my dual screen stuff set up. Works wonderful. I don't like how small the second monitor is, but it's no big deal. Um, I... I, I get used to it. So. Okay, that's the other thing too is is that I really like already typing on the keys. Um, they're not too hard to push. They're very easy to push. Uh, I especially like these backlit keys. I mean, that's very ha handy. Um, hopefully, it lasts for a, a, a while. You know, like a long time. So, of course, this thing again. It states it's got a 12-hour battery life. If I get 12 hours of it, that's great. That beats my stupid tablet. That tablet gets maybe four but then if i'm heavily using it it gets like two it's got no power and it's got a atom one gigahertz processor it's okay but i need more power and it's got like two gigabytes of ram i think so going to this is going to be like insane and plus it's also full hd sweet <laughs> um Oh, is it? I do hope to get my uh, wireless headphones pair because I hate having the wires on them. Uh, my tablet, I never can figure out the Bluetooth. I don't know why. It's worked on my desktop. It's not worked on my on the tablet. So hopefully it works on this. So yeah, I'll start the camera again when the desktop comes up. All right, guys. <clears throat> so I'm here editing the video a couple days later because I'm so busy. Um. Apparently, when I run out of cam on uh, of uh, room on this camera, I found out that I guess it erases stuff because it looks like it overridden three different files when I when I when the camera got full. So anyway, this is I'm editing on this laptop now. It's flawless. Um, I have everything installed that I want to get installed on it. Um, I got you know my office on here. I got Office 365 for the other computer too. Um, it's about 30 second boot time with this, uh, but I lost that, I lost the comparison to my other desktop, I lost a lot of stuff, 
which freaking sucks because I'm pissed off at Canon for that. I lost everything um, loading the desktop onward. Uh, it is nowhere to be found. Um, I'm going through this now, and a lot of it oh, yeah, is okay. like dual dual copied almost. Yeah, and this one says can't play items unplayable. Please reacquire the content. Great. So this is all messed up. So I'm trying to figure that out now. All the numbers completely messed up with this thing. So that's why I'm looking at now. As I had to, all the numbers are messed up, all of them. So I just found another part. I think that's the right one though. Pain in the ass. And then. I gotta tone the quality down in this because I, I psh, don't bother me. I got only got it's really eating up my batteries. I only got like 48 minutes left on this, so I'm gonna do this as fast as I can. So, you know, if you don't see the rest of this, I mean, if little uh, parts of it. Um, if you see it like it looks like pretty smooth, like from transition from each part of the video, then I probably did okay. Um, other than that, I gotta turn the quality down on this camera because it's eating my battery, my thing, which sucks because I want to do a video out later with the on my Chapter Guy channel. Um, I'm running off my little uh, USB dingy because the hard drive over there is plugged in. Um, so, anyway, thanks for watching this video. Comment, rate, subscribe. Hopefully, you enjoyed the unboxing. Sorry, it was really choppy. Um, if it's not choppy, I probably was able to find it. But, uh, what are you gonna do?